Welcome to Shark Attack Today, available on sharkattackonline.com and 101.1 FM radio. I'm Matt, here with Olivia and Michaela. Here are your announcements for Friday, February 5th, 2016. All hosts and members who, are <clears throat> who will compete in the State Leadership Conference in Charleston this March, your remaining balance for registration must be paid today. No late payments will be accepted. See Ms. Fisher for, or Mr. Chapman to make your payments. FCA will host a fifth quarter tonight. Immediately following the home basketball game, there will be free pizza, live band, and drama. Everyone is invited. The pep rally will be next Thursday, February 11th. You can sign up to participate in the following activities. The balloon popping relay, a girl or boy pair is needed for this activity, so find a partner and sign up. Or the hoodie challenge. You will be racing with your legs and arms and the sleeves of a hoodie like this. <laughs> Sign up by Wednesday outside Miss Rogers' door. Room F226. Now over to today's history. I'm Megan here with David and Jesse. On this day in 1952, the first Don't Walk signs were installed in New York City. In entertainment in 1958, the Grammy Awards organi organization was formed. And in sports, in 2006, the Pittsburgh Steelers defeated the Seattle Seahawks in the Super Bowl 40. This is this Sunday. The Panthers will play the Broncos in Super Bowl 50. Let's go, Panthers! <laughs> <laughs> now over to today's trivia. I'm Haley here with Jess. Today we have a history question. Who led the first journey around the world? Was it A. Christopher Columbus, B. Ferdinand Magellan, or C. Vasco da Gama? Um, I mean, I really don't know. But I feel like they're trying to trick me. So I'm not going to say Christopher Columbus. Um, I'll say B. The correct answer is B, Ferdinand Magellan. Now over to today's poll. I'm Daniel, here with Mason and Mickey. Today's poll question is, after a breakup, do you want to be friends or never talk to each other again? You know what I say? Never talk to her again. Why can't we be friends? I hate when people make a big deal out of it. That means not be friends. <laughs> I guess. But you say I'm just a friend. But you say <laughs> Okay, I'm just according a to our online survey, 68% of voters said that after a breakup, they still wanted to be friends, and 32% said they never want to speak again. Fake in line. Yeah. Now back to the anchor desk. Thanks, and that wraps up Shark Attack today. Check out sharkattackonline.com for new articles, photos, reacts, and short films. Have a great day, St. James.